So hello everybody, hopefully, hopefully you enjoying your day. Just thought I'd come on for an update because I have some updates for ya. So last week I told you guys I was out of ketosis. So one of the things that took me out of ketosis was um, sangria. So um, gonna keep that in mind. No worries about getting back into to ketosis. So my plans were to uh, wait until the next following week, which is today, Monday. I've started day one in, into back on a keto diet. And also we'll be starting uh, the detox as well with the Reboot by Joe juice, the green juice that I'm going to be using um, to detox as well as being ketosis as well. So um, I am going to probably take about, I think it takes about three days on average for myself to get back into ketosis. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to start the juice probably later this week, the green juice. So um, maybe Thursday, Friday. So, and then um, not sure how long I'm going to do the green juice. Um, maybe for about five or six, five or five to 10 days. Um, so we'll see how that goes. So I, when I came out of ketosis, um, 24 hours later, I could feel it. So I really, oh, and let me explain something. I need to, let me reel it back a little bit. Cause one of the things I didn't tell you guys is that I was still in ketosis, even, even on the, um, the balance plate. So even when I transitioned to the balance plate, I stayed in ketosis. So I'm so happy about that because that means that I can experience these benefits and still be, you know, still be in ketosis at the same time, be on a different plan, a more reasonable plan to me that's going to, that I can follow through on a long, long-term basis. So uh, some of the things that I noticed, I became more sluggish. I didn't have the uh, as much energy as I had before. I can tell that um, with the ketones, they help, they help you manage your day better. So I was putting in a little bit more effort to manage my day. So, um, and another thing too, the ketones help with your, I would say, controlling your appetite better. So I did notice a little change in regards to my cravings, my appetite. So after 24 hours, I knew that, hey, I need to, I need to get back on, on keto and then follow this back through and just not, <laughs> and not, you know, make the mistake that I did before. Uh, so another thing that I was going to do as well as keep up with the, the exercise, I saw some huge benefits when I was doing the, the treadmill, the walking, keeping up with the walking and doing those kettlebells. It's just something about the, that combination that really helped me tremendously. So, uh, there was something else. I know I keep forgetting. There's something else I have to say. Uh, having brain fogs, got, And that's another thing. Brain fogs. Uh, they back. <laughs> All right. So, I'm going to come on later to show you guys my juicer that I, that I use. Um, I bought this juicer six years ago, and it's still in good shape so i'm going to use that for my juices the juice that i am uh, the recipe that i have is still keto friendly so um happy about that as well so the ingredients that i'm using are keto friendly ingredients so i think that's about it so <laughs> if i think of anything you'll just have to wait till the next time but till next time talk to you guys soon